Well, some local groups want to make sure everyone stays warm as the weather gets colder. Joining us now is the president and co-founder of the John Fiore Foundation, Ron Ottman, the CEO of the Niagara Falls Boys and Girls Club, Rebecca Vincheski, and the marketing manager for Easy Loan Auto Sales, Tim Chandler. Thank you all for being here. Thanks, Thanks Scott, for having us. us. Let's talk about this coat drive that you're having because we're getting into that time of year where this kind of thing is important. Yeah, it really is. Um, we wanted to do something a little bit different this year. This is our, our first coat drive that we're spearheading. And we we're lucky enough to partner with Easy Loan Auto Sales. And we've had a long-term relationship with Rebecca and the, the Niagara Falls Boys and Girls Club. So we've thought it's a perfect fit. Um, you know, our foundation is based around Niagara Falls. My, myself, my wife, and my cousin, our three board members are all from Niagara Falls. And just thought it's a perfect match. So, You work a lot with kids and you know in the winter time that sometimes there's a need there that uh, that they really do need these kind of coats and may not have them and that, that can be really detrimental. A hundred percent. There's a huge need and when you think about the weather and how cold it gets and our kids are often outside waiting for the buses, you know, walking to school and we just want to give them one less barrier so that they can start their school day warm, strong and focus on what they really need to focus on which is learning and being healthy. Yeah, exactly. Um, how are you uh, providing support to this? Uh, we, our, all three of our locations are available to drop off uh, coats and jackets during business hours. So we are in Niagara Falls, uh, Niagara Falls Boulevard, South Transit Road in Lockport, and Elmwood Ave in Buffalo right down the street. So you're given the uh, the uh, kind of logistics of it there to, to get this done. But, uh, you know, as far as the uh, the, the need for this, um, it, I feel like this is a good time to have a coat drive. A lot of times we see them once we get further into the weather, and by then you've already, you know, had people who've had the need. This way you're right. kind of getting ahead of it a little bit. Right. Yeah, it's uh, we wanted it to start it earlier. Obviously we know with fall coming, the, the colder weather follows. So we figured it was a perfect time for the month of October to do that. Um, we, you know, we want to thank North, uh, North Star, Big East, Dry Cleaning. <laughs> They're going to be handling all the gently used and cleaning those for us. So we can't thank them enough for that. But uh, it's very important that we have the three locations. We also have Service Drive Center on Kenmore Avenue in Kenmore to drop off locations. Um, also on our flyer, on our website, um, if somebody's local, they can't make it to one of those sites, we're more than happy to come pick up or make arrangements to do that. And then in addition, we are looking for support from the community. So if anybody visits our website at www.johnfioreifoundation.com, you can make a donation. We will match up to a $1,000 donation to and buy I coats. And I think you can speak to the fact that, you know, if you make this donation and bring a code in that, I mean, this this is one of those real tangible ways that you can make a difference. And you see it in these kids, I'm sure. It has immediate impact. And being able to do this drive now allows us to get coats in the hands before they're needed. And it even allows us to have stock ready so that when we see a kid coming off the bus or coming to our club and they just have a hoodie on and it's zero degrees windy, we can go right back and say here and, and, you know, immediately solve the need. Awesome. Well, thank you all so much. Uh, let's hope it's a huge success for you. This is a great thing yeah. you're doing. Thanks for coming in and talking about thank it. Thank you, Scott, for thank having you. us. We all appreciate right. it. You bet. Well, as Mike has been saying, next week we may start to need those coats. It's looking like it's going to be quite chilly out there, maybe even cold. We'll see if Mike makes that distinction.